Yeah, welcome to today's lesson. We are looking at pre-vocational studies, paper one, agriculture. In the previous lesson, I looked at questions one to 30. For today's lesson, we are going to look at questions 31 to 60 and we'll be done with agriculture. Let's go straight to question 31. Which of the following is a feed addictive? A, A. B. Salt. C. Silage. D. Soilage. E. Straw. The correct answer is B, which is salt. Salt is commonly added to animal feed to improve taste and provide essential minerals, so it is a feed addictive. Question 32. The advantage of serving animal feed in troughs is that it reduces a cannibalism among the animals b daily feed intake of animal c incidence of animal diseases d quantity of droppings produced e wastage of feed supplied the correct answer is e wastage of feed supplied question 33 Drugs and antibiotics added to the feed of farm animals are commonly classified as A. Additives B. Con concentrates C. Rough edges D. Succulents E. Supplement The correct answer is option E, which is supplement. Supplements include drugs. Antibiotics, vitamins, and minerals added to enhance animal health and productivity. Question 34 says the causative organism of coeciosis in rabbits is a bacteria, B fungi, C nematode, D protozoa, E virus. The correct answer is D protozoa. Cosidiosis is caused by protozoa parasites. Question 35. Red water fever in sheep is transmitted through A. Contaminated water. B. Body contact. C. Insect bite. D. Moldy feet. E. Wet litters. The correct answer is insect bite, which is option C. It is usually spread by ticks and causes red-colored urine, hence the name red water fever. Question 36 says, Scoby in farm animals is caused by deficiency of what vitamin? We have A, C, D, E, and K. The correct answer is caused by deficiency of vitamin C. So that's option B. Question 37. A parasite which uses water snail as host before infesting farm animals is A. Flu. B. Liver flu. C. Round one. D. Tape one. E. Tick. The correct answer for question 37 is B. Liver flu. Question 38. A farmer who observed frequent sleeping, anemia, and intermittent fever in his goods should suspect the spread of what? The correct answer is option D, which is trypanosomiasis. Option D. These symptoms are classic signs of trypanosomiasis, which is a disease spread Tessa flies. All right, question 39 says, the following are control measures for mastitis in dairy farms except one of them. A, cleaning of milking, milking equipment. B, disinfecting milking parlor. C, sanitizing farmer's hands. D, shaving hairs around hooder. E, washing the animal's hooder. The correct answer for question 39 is option D. Option D, 
is shaving hairs around Buddha. Why hygiene is crucial? Shaving hair is not a standard or required measure for mastitis prevention. Question 40. Prefish is an example of A. Amphibians. B. Crustaceans. C. Mammals. D. Mollus. E. Reptiles. The correct answer is crustaceans. Crustaceans, which is option B. Crayfish belong to the group crustacean, which also includes crabs and lobsters. Question 41. Which of the following types of fish are cartilaginous? The right answer is dogfish and shark. A. We have catfish and stockfish. B. Carp and mudfish. C. Dogfish and shark. Yes, that's the correct answer. D. Salmon and herring. E. Tilapia and mercury. All right, question 42 says, Smoking of fishes is mostly practiced by fish farmers because it A. Drains off oil from fishes. B. Reduces the palatability of fishes. C. Reduces moisture content of fishes. D. Removes hard scales from fishes. E. Softens hard bones in fishes. The correct answer is C. Reduces moisture content of fishes. So, the right answer is C. Question 43 says, The forest product that serves as a raw material for tissue industries is A. Fiber, B. Gum, C. Pulp, D. Rope, E. Timber. The correct answer is pulp, which is option C. All right. Question number 44. The availability of timber in northern Nigeria is highly reduced by A. Afforestation, B. Deforestation, C. Regeneration, D. Selective exploration, E. Tongian farming. The correct answer is deforestation, which is option B. Question 45. The following are forest regulations in Nigeria except the ban on A. Acquisition of forest licenses. B. Bush burning around forests. C. Collection of forest firewood. D. Cutting down of young trees. E. Farming activities in forest reserves. The correct answer is A. Acquisition of forest licenses. Use figure 1.7 to answer questions 46 and 47. Question 46. Which of the following live farm animals are packaged for sale using the structure? A. Bees. B. Chicks. C. Goats. D. Grass cutters. E. Rabbits. The correct answer is chicks, which is option B. Question 47. The function of the part labored I is for A, feeding, B, handling, C, inspection, D, remover, E, ventilation. The correct answer is ventilation, which is option E. Question 48. An important precaution that should be taken when canning farm produce for sale is that the A. Container must be painted, B. Container must be sterilized, C. Farmer must have correct NAVDAC number, D. Produce must be frozen, E. Produce must be in liquid form. The correct answer is option B. D. Container must be sterilized. Question 49. Use the information below to answer questions 49 and 50. Balogun Oil Mill planned to sell 5,000 liters of palm oil at 250 naira per liter in the mill's warehouse. Which of the following methods will be most suitable for the manager to advertise the produce to consumers? A. Agricultural shows. B. B. Boards. C. Home visits. The online services, e telephone calls. 
the correct answer is online services, which is option D. Question 50. If the quantity of the palm oil produced increased to 10,000 liters, why other factors remain constant? What would be the outcome on the price of the oil in the warehouse? It will. Which option among the options is correct? The correct answer is C, decreased below 250, 250 Naira per liter, which is option C. Question 51. Farm gate price is best defined as a price at which A, agro industries buy farm produce as raw material, B, farmers sell from produce direct to consumers, C, government buy of excess produce in the market, D, marketing boards sell farm produce in large quantities, E, middlemen purchase farm produce directly from farmers. The correct answer is option E. Middle main purchase farm produce directly from farmers. Use the farm record of Mama May's meal shown below to answer questions 52 and 53. Kindly go through the record. We have various dates, work done, labor used, and number of days used. Question 52 says The farm record illustrated is a farm budget, b farm diary. C. Input record. D. Inventory record. E. Production record. The correct answer is production record, which is option E. The primary aim of keeping the record in Maman May's meal by the manager is to A. Calculate wages of laborers. B. Determine the number of laborers used. C. Keep track of daily farm activities. D. Monitor work done by laborers. E. Secure long-term loans easily. The correct answer is option D. Monitor work done by laborers. We are almost done. Let's take a look at question questions 54 to 60. Question 54. A dairy farmer will benefit from the installation of computer sets for his transactions because it will A. Ease his access to sales record. B. Help him keep track of his stock. C. Help raise his standard of living. D. Increase his hired laborer's wages. E. Lead him to install electricity in the farm. The correct answer is B. It will help him keep track of his stock. Question 55. Sales of spent layers should be recorded on the same side as dash in bookkeeping. Among the options we have, the correct answer is D, receipts, not grand totals, net worth purchases, or total expenses. Question 56. Which of the following items should be recorded on purchase invoice of a bee farmer? A, feed, B, honey, C, labor, D, smoker, E, was. The correct answer is feed. Question 57. The function of a broker in stock exchange market is to A. Arrange foreign investors for companies. B. Connect buyers and sellers representatives. C. Purchase and hold stock when demand is low. D. Sell stock when there is no public offer. E. Verify number of transactions yearly. The correct answer for question 57 is B. Connect buyers and sellers representatives. Question 58. The following are importance of agricultural stock exchange except the A. Creation of opportunities for investment. B. Promotion of corporate governance. C. Raising of capital for agriculture. D. Redistribution of national wealth. E. Sharing of dividends to shareholders. The correct answer is option D. Redistribution of national wealth. Question 59. Export promotion boosts agriculture by A. Attracting new investment in the oil companies. B. Creating bilateral relationship between marketers. 
C. Encouraging the immigration of youth to foreign lands. D. Encouraging the purchase of products. E. Increasing the income of the export crop producers. Question 59, the correct answer is E. Increasing the income of the export crop producers. The final question, question 60 says, the major agricultural produce exported from northern Nigeria are A, egg, cod oil, lard and fora, B, hides, crayfish, wool and honey, C, lattice, coconut oil, cashew nut and gali, D, plantain, palm oil, walnut and ginger, E, sesam, granite, ginger and shogun. The correct answer is option E. Thank you for staying with me. We are done with everything about agricultural science. For those of you that have not seen lesson one, kindly go back and look at lesson one. It's going to be very helpful. And the next lesson, we'll be looking at paper two of pre-vocational studies, which is home economies. See you then.